Hello, goaltending students. My name is Guillaume Duclair. Welcome to Goalie Smarts. Your defense are the guys you're supposed to rely on to not leave you in the dust. You see, because in hockey, people try to score goals. And even though you might be really good at stopping the puck, if five guys are running a gangbang session in your crease, you are going to get lit up. Who's to blame in that situation? Maybe it's the defenseman who looks like he stopped growing in the fifth grade. Sorry, bro, you can't skate around on a phone book. Defense might not be the best position for you. Or maybe it's that guy aimlessly swinging his stick around like a pendulum, hoping he'll magically hit the puck and be a hero without doing any actual work. Once again, without good defensemen, you are completely screwed. So in this episode of Goalie Smarts, I'm going to teach you how to make up for your defenseman's lack of skill and effort, and how to find shady, unrealistic ways around this problem. This is Goalie Smarts episode 32, how to deal with bad defensemen. Step one, become a motivational speaker. Maybe your defensemen aren't trying because every night they go to bed thinking negatively. Maybe they keep themselves up at night and whisper to themselves, I have so much more potential. And that's why they can't cover the guy right in front of the fucking crease. If that's the case, I'd study up on Ty Lopez and Eric Thomas videos, and I would immediately start vomiting wordy garbage on them every time they forget to do their fucking job. Hey, what's up, man? Listen, so I know your dad hates you, okay? I know you've been kicked around and stomped on, but you can always call child services, okay? And you can always call the cops. If you want to succeed as bad as you can breathe, you can do it. You just have to stop being a lazy cock. Say it with me. I am not a cock. I am not a cock. I am not a cock. Step two, blame your defense for everything. You see, it is a defenseman's job to make up for 100% of your shortcomings. So when they don't do their job, you need to tell them. It is their fault if a guy comes in on a breakaway. It is their fault if someone gets a pass right in front of the net. And it is their fault when you ejaculate early when you're with a girl. No matter what happens, tell them. Do your job, buddy. Please don't die. Please don't die. No, 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 no! This is entirely your fault. And if they ever try to blame you for something, sue their parents. Step three, host a training camp. Whoever runs your team's skill sessions has clearly failed you. So since you know so much about defense, why don't you put together some sort of training camp and teach them how to do their jobs? Yo, what's up, man? How you doing? So listen, I'm just gonna be real with you. You're probably one of the worst defensemen uh, of all time. Don't get mad, okay? Maybe it's because I know something that you don't, okay? So what I've done is I've put together this three-day training camp, right? It's called How to Cover the Guy in Front of the Net. Three days is gonna be a full comprehensive camp. I'm gonna teach you everything you need to know. Um, so anyways, 700 bucks, free donuts. Let me know when you wanna sign up, all right, buddy? Thank you for watching Goalie Smarts, episode 32, posting every Wednesday. Fuck yeah! This episode was suggested by Noah Balmer. If you think that you can be like Noah and give me an idea that I'm actually gonna do, comment that idea below down in the comment section. Otherwise, I'm Guillaume Duclair, and I'm getting the fuck out of here. Betches!